So FreeBSD has made it to 30 years old. Amazing. Let's talk about it. So FreeBSD made it to, to 30 years. That's incredible. Let's, um, let's see what they have to say to it. Now, I know I'm a bit late to the party on this. It was last month, but a lot of stuff happened. There we go. On the FreeBSD Foundations page, happy birthday. I'm very late to the party. I know that. It was on, in June. It's now July. So this is almost a month late. Apologies for that. So going through all the versions of, of FreeBSD from 1 all the way to 13.2, the amount of things that these developers have put into this and, and kept it as open source, and it just it's amazing. It really is. It, it, to keep this kind of project going must take an incredible amount of dedication from the, the, the FreeBSD project. And let's let's have a look at the team here. Now, we all know about Deb, very vocal in her advocacy for FreeBSD, which is great. See her on, on Twitter quite a lot. Likes to go out running with her, with her dog, which is fantastic. And the rest of the team now. So it's... Um, yeah, 30 years. Can you can you believe it? Ideas for celebrating. Introduce someone to FreeBSD by sharing the training materials on the FreeBSD resources page. You should all do that. Always, always try and introduce at least one person to FreeBSD. Maybe they're just a Windows user and they're just not getting what they want done and then they're, or they're fed up with paying for stuff or anything like that. Just introduce them. It's, you know, with all the things that are going on with, with the Linux world, and we'll get to that in another video. It's um, a viable, viable alternative. Check out the 30th anniversary issue of the FreeBSD Journal. I might just do that while we're here. Let's see. I'm not from Yorkshire, I promise. <laughs> yeah. Now time flies. Blimey, Venom. <laughs> it does bring back some memories. <laughs> yeah, it's amazing. It's... Um... <laughs> When I think back of my own journey on FreeBSD, it's just quite an in incredible way to learn stuff. And the amount of things that I have learned, I've taken into my professional career. I may not have used FreeBSD in my professional career or have used it, but very sparingly, for want of a better word, the problem with being the only person in an organization that knows how to use FreeBSD is that all the support then falls on yourself. Now, that was fine for me because it wasn't a huge organization and I could live with that, but it's not easy. One of my lights went off. Battery's almost dead. Never mind. I mean, look, this is full of useful information, this. It's quite amazing that we've, uh, we've got all the way to 30 years. Can you? It's just, I know, keep saying it, but it does just. It, it blows you away. All the innovations, incredible. Absolutely incredible. So FreeBSD, keep going. FreeBSD Foundation, you have got a great team now. Fantastic leadership. Keep going. We appreciate you. I'm going to leave it there. There's not a, a huge amount I can say except happy birthday, FreeBSD. You have a special place in my world and uh, I will forever be in your debt. You've given me so many things to learn, so many challenges to overcome. Thank you. I'll, uh, I'll leave it there. I'll see you in the next video, everybody. Please do give it a like, subscribe, share. The, uh, the support you guys have given me is just incredible. So thank you for that. And as always, I'll see you in the next video. Take care.